today we will be talking about Marie Antoinette, the last queen of France. Before she died, the French Revolution. Yo guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I have another Fate Grand Order figure, this time by Pulchra, featuring Japan's rendition of Marie Antoinette, the last Queen of France. Anyways, that is the box art. Here's the top and the bottom. And let's go unbox her. All right, she's out of her box and uh, assembly looks easy enough. There's only three pieces to this figure assembly. With the base, the figure, and her uh, pillow hat. Anyways, there are three pegs on the base. Two go into her left foot and one goes on the right. So let's uh, push this in firmly so she won't fall down. Alright, I think that she's about good. And now we put her like pillow hat thing on her head. It's actually magnetic, so it won't fall too easily. All right, there you go, fully assembled. All right, time for close-ups. And Polkra actually did a fairly good job with this figure. Like the face sculpt is really nice. The pose is really nice. Looks like, or, yeah, she looks just what she does in uh, the game, so that's pretty cool. The paint looks uh, really good. I like the metallic accents on her armor, like her two, her two pieces of chest armor and her uh, shoulder plates. Their metallic like emulates, I don't know, metal shielding, armor, etc. Nice touch. The only complaint I can kind of really talk about those the uh, the base and how it's playing. You know, like with other fate figures, generally they at least have the summoning circle, which I think is pretty cool. This one's just like a uh, a textured black plastic base, which like would be fine if uh, her shoes weren't black, but they are, so her shoes kind of blend in with the base, which I think is a, is a downside, especially for uh, for people who do like taking pictures of their figures and stuff, I guess. It kind of blends in. And even though it is part of the character design, I think her hat's like a tad ridiculous. It's, it's just massive. It's like, it's literally like a pillow or a bean bag on her head. But like, yeah, overall, I, I do like this figure a lot. It's really unique, really cool, and a different fate figure, you know? All right, it is the end of the video. I'll put up some pros and cons on the screen. For you guys to see of uh what i think about it um i'll also throw up a i don't know a screenshot of where to currently get this figure for the cheapest price and like if you if you look closely like i said earlier her because it is a black base and her boots at the base are black uh her feet look uh, a little weird yeah but it's not too big a deal uh yeah for you, you collectors out there like me there are a bunch of new fake grand order uh like figures that were leaked you can look at them up on otaku hq it's pretty cool anyways if uh you like this video uh give a like <coughs> subscribe and i'll see you next time thanks for watching bye